Ito ang Shense. Paboritong gamit ng mga Pilipino sa kusina. Kaya mo bang gumawa nito kahit na wala kang gamit na pangkarpintero? Tara, subukan natin. Few months ago, I made this uh, wooden ladle and I, I find it very nice to use. So now I'm going to show you how to make one. I have a uh, wood here from a crate. Then uh, I'm going to curb it to make another one like this one, like this wooden ladle. But I will make it. Uh, I will make the handle longer. Okay, so guys, uh, let's do it. So here we have a wood, wood plank, around four inches by one and a half feet. So what we're going to do is to trace this wooden ladle here. But this time I'm going to make the handle longer. Then this one will just uh, then this one I will just extend the handle. Maybe until here there's a crack here, so it will be just somewhere here. Okay, so let's so so here we're going to clamp on this uh, also DIY bench bench clamp. This one is very handy. Huh? It, it is very useful for this clamp because you know, big uh, clamp is uh, expensive. So that's why I decided to make this uh, wooden clamp. This is very nice for uh, sewing. Clamp it there, or maybe here. Then instead of cutting here, which takes time and effort and also energy, so we're just going to chop it out. So what we're going to do next is to just chop it out, this part. There. Very fast and very easy. Whatever you do, try to find a way to make it faster and easier. So now we can start chopping this out. See, very easy. Now we can start carving.
Now we have our ladder. So this one I have to cut a bit. Here. So now we have to make this one, we have to make this part this way, we have to curve it this way, make this part shallow, uh, I mean deep. Don't forget to use this uh, wooden protection or else your uh, butcher's knife will be damaged. Yeah. You're almost there. So we just have to Refine everything and then we're done. Then we are going to curve this a bit, this part. Be careful not to overcut. So we are almost done. Uh roughing in, I mean making the shape. Now we are going to refine everything. We are going to refine the curve because this one is very rough and not even. You might be wondering why I am using this knife, this kind of knife or Taga in Tagalog. The reason is that so that at least even if you don't have any uh, chisel or special tools for wood carving, we can still do. It's just a matter of wanting to do it. Now the back is refined, already fine. You can also do this way.
So there we have now. There you go. We already have a ladder. See? From scrap wood to a ladder. So here's the ladder, guys. After refining it by scraping it with knife. This will protect your Teflon kitchen pans because Teflon are expensive as you know it. And more, this one is more convenient because the handle is longer. You see, the hang, handle is longer so you will be far away from the cooking pan. This one you can make, okay, make for yourself. You can even, you can even sell it if, if you can mass produce or you can give it to your relatives. After watching this video, you will realize that uh, everything is easy as long as you want to do it. And if anybody asks you, why do you have to make one when you can just buy? Ask them, why do you have to uh, cook food when you can just buy food? Okay, so that's all for now, guys. Uh, this is Nadne TV. Till next time, thank you very much for watching.